you know. We're going to do a recap, and we're, we're getting better at doing recaps, and one of the things that helps is to be able to show visually as we verbally summarize what we did. So this was a C major extended chords variation, and this was the C major traditional chords variation, and then this is the C full tonality chords. I'm, I'm smiling because I know we're about to play this again. <clears throat> Sirs and madams, wherever you are, as always, thank you for your time and attention. This is a recap of part four, valid and variations in C full tonality. We have completed the third variation, which is over here. We started with variation one, which uses C major traditional chords, referenced here. And we came up with this. We then, in part, actually part one was the melody, part two was the harmony. Part three, we altered the chords. And we said we're still going to stay in C major, but we're going to use some extended chords. And those are down here. And this is what we came up with. And we said, well, that sounds different. But the more we listen to it, online or offline, the more we kind of get interested by it. And then in today, we just wrapped up getting the new the chords in for variation three, which is C full tonality, and those are these chords. And this is what we came up with. And we said, Oh my God, or your variation thereof. <clears throat> if I hadn't heard where we came from, I'd barely know what the heck we're at, we're at. Now, so far, we've only we haven't changed the melody. The melody is identical in all of these variations. And then in variation two and variation one, the backbone is the same. Here, we've, we've further changed the backbone. And as a first cut at the melody, we just left it alone the way it is. So we used a metaphor, uh, a physiological metaphor, where we said, in essence, We have a skeleton. All right, we're going to hide that for a minute. This is the um, skeleton. This is the, the, the muscles. Wrong color. Muscles. And this is the skin. And so in variation one, we had C 
major traditional skeleton in variation two we kept the skeleton no we didn't keep the, we, we kept the muscles and the skin but we didn't but we changed the skeleton and in variation three we changed the skeleton and the muscles sounds confusing doesn't it <clears throat> where we want to go next is we want to work with uh, what I would call and hide that for now I want to call a new layer a layer of uh, I need a color here I've already used red, blue, and green. All I've not left is orange. All right. So I want to I want to call it ornamentation. And an example of ornamentation is playing arpeggios, taking the cadence. Da 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 da. Uh, but it could be other things. And ornament, ornamentation could also be uh, changes in tempo, changes in dynamics. So far, we're, we're pretty simplistic. Everything's at the same volume, which is MF, mezzo forte. So what we're going to do, just as at the end of uh, each one of these parts, we played the version we're just going to play Zerza Mouth, wherever you are. Here is variation three. No ornamentation. There's a skeleton, muscles, and skin. I'm sure you'll agree with me that uh, we either need a new skin or a lot of makeup. <laughs> Thank you, as always, for your time and attention, and as keep on streaming. <laughs>